Hello everybody! Today I'll show you how to see or delete saved passwords to your online accounts in Google Chrome, Opera, Yandex Browser, Mozilla Firefox, Microsoft Edge or other browsers. You will also learn how to set up autofilling for logins and addresses as well as banking card details. Dear friends, if you need to recover deleted data, use Utilities by Hetman Software. Follow the link in the description to visit our website, download a utility for free and install it. Then start disk analysis. When the process is over, it will show the files available for recovery, and you will be able to bring them back. Our blog features quick guides to solve all kinds of problems faced by Windows users. Our channel and blog offer solutions for any issues, from installing the operating system to remote administration and connecting mobile devices. Our specialists will be glad to answer your questions in comments to videos and articles. Any modern browser has a function to save passwords. It saves you the trouble of having to enter your registration data every time. Few people can remember hundreds of logins and passwords to their favorite websites and online services. But what can you do if the autofill doesn't work for some reason and you don't remember the password or login? Another situation is when you want to delete all autofill data from your browser, such as logins, passwords, addresses and banking details to make sure that other people don't see them. Let's find out how to set up saving passwords in other autofill data and how to find all saved passwords in your browser and protect them. Let's start with Google Chrome. To see all passwords saved by your browser, go to Menu – Settings – Advanced – Passwords and Forms – Manage Passwords. This menu contains all passwords saved by your browser in the format Website – Username – Password. By default, the password is hidden. To view it, click on the three-dot button next to a certain website and select Details. Click on the eye-shaped button to see the password. However, you will be able to see it only if this function is enabled. By default, all browsers have this function on. If you don't want your password and login saved, disable this function and enter logins and passwords manually every time. In Yandex browser, Go to Menu – Settings – Advanced – Passwords and Forms – Manage Passwords. This menu contains all passwords saved by your browser in the format Website – Username – Password. By default, the password is hidden. To view it, click on it and choose Details. Sometimes the system may ask for your account password. Enter it. However, you will be able to see it only if this function is enabled. In Opera, go to Menu – Settings – Privacy and Security – Show all passwords. This menu contains all passwords saved by your browser in the format Website – Username – Password. By default, the password is hidden. To view it, click on it and choose Details. Sometimes the system may ask for your account password, so you enter it. They will only be saved when this function is active. By default, this function is on. If necessary, disable this function and enter logins and passwords manually every time. In Mozilla Firefox, go to Menu – Privacy and Security – Forms and Passwords – Saved Logins. This menu contains all logins and passwords saved by your browser in the format Website – Username – Last Changed. By default, the passwords are not displayed. To show them, click on the button Show Passwords. If you don't want your passwords and logins saved, disable this function and enter logins and passwords manually every time. You may have noticed that unlike other browsers, Mozilla Firefox doesn't ask for your Windows account password to view logins and passwords in the browser. For this purpose, Mozilla has got a master password. When you set it, nobody is going to see your logins and passwords without you. And Microsoft Edge. Go to Settings – Advanced Settings – View Advanced Settings – Manage My Saved Passwords. This menu contains all passwords saved by your browser in the format Website – Username – Password. I don't have many entries here, as I don't use Edge, just for example. However, in this menu you can only delete or change the saved password, but you cannot view it. 
As Edge is the browser built into the system, with an integrated security system and other Windows settings, its account data is kept in a special system location. To view it, go to Control Panel, Credential Manager, Web Credentials. Go to our channel to watch a video about Control Panel and how to start it. You will find the link in the description below. All logins and passwords saved with Edge are kept here. To view any password, click on an arrow next to a website name. Select Show next to Password, and to do it you will also need to enter your account password, the one you use to log into the system. If you use, Google Chrome, uh, if you use Chrome Sync and Google Account, all your logins and passwords are also synchronized automatically to your Google account. You can view them all in your Google account page. Passwords.google.com. I will give the link in the description. They are synchronized both from your computer and Android devices. To see a password, select View. To delete a password, choose Remove. I'd like to say a couple of words about the autofill function in browsers, which is usually found next to the function of remembering passwords from websites. This function is similar to saving logins and passwords. In the same way, your browser can remember names, addresses, phone numbers, and even bank card details. How does it work? For example, you go to a website and want to make a purchase or fill in a certain form or questionnaire. When you click on the fields to enter data, your browser will automatically suggest to use the data it has already saved. Just choose the variant you need. Th things are the same when it comes to bank cards data. Usually when you enter data into a certain field, browsers suggest saving such information. You can view or add such autofill data in the autofill menu of, of your browser. It can be found in the login and password settings. For example, in Yandex browser. Go to Menu, Settings, Advanced, Passwords and Forms, Manage Passwords. Click Enable Autofill to fill out forms in a single click. As you see, you can add the address to be filled in automatically. Or a bank card. Such settings look similarly in other browsers. I think there is no need to go into details for each of them. Talking of browsers used for smartphones, they all have similar functions and settings. For example, Chrome mobile version. Go to Menu, Settings, Passwords to see all saved passwords. From here, you can also uh, get to the page passwords.google.com, which I have mentioned today. In the menu Autofill and Payments, you can see saved addresses and card details, or add more data. In mobile versions of browsers, many items may have different names, but the point is the same. You can delete saved logins and passwords as well as other autofill data in the same menus where you go to view them. Just choose Remove or Delete next to a password or click on a cross-shaped icon or a trash bin icon. However, only Mozilla Firefox gives the opportunity to delete all of them at once by clicking Remove All. All other browsers can delete them one by one only. You can delete all autofill data of any browser at once with CCleaner. Visit our channel and watch a detailed video about this program. You will find the link in the description below. At the moment, we are interested in one of the possible ways you can use it. To do it, Start the program and go to Cleaner menu. The utility suggests to select the data you want to remove. In the tab Windows, among others, you can check the boxes Saved form information and Saved password for Microsoft Edge and Internet Explorer. In the tab Applications, you can also check Saved passwords and Saved form information for other browsers which you use. Choose your options and click on Analyze. When it is over, click on Run Cleaner. As a result, all autofill forms and saved passwords will be removed. That is all for now. If you found this video useful, click the like button below and subscribe to our channel to see more. Thank you for watching and good luck!